Yo, what up, guys? We just got back from watching Night Swim. The best movie of the year. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so Night Swim's a movie directed by Tyrell's favorite director. Who's that again? <laughs> oh. All right, so this movie stars Wyatt Russell and some other random kids and female characters. <laughs> All right, so this movie stars Wyatt Russell and a bunch of other random actors, right? Um, now, this movie's about a family who... The dad is a baseball player. I guess he's retired. He has an illness that caused him to retire. And they, they're moving, uh, looking for a new house. And they seem to find one on the market for cheap. I wonder why. <laughs> but they find a house on the market. Uh, they buy it. They see it has a nice pool. And they just decide, let's just start swimming in it. And even when things they start seeing things, they don't bat an eye until basically everything's ruined. Yeah, that, that sounds up pretty good. Yeah. What's something that you liked about this movie? Um, it wasn't too long. Yeah, I think the runtime was pretty good. Uh, it was like an hour and forty minutes, um, and it didn't seem to like drag. But no, it, not at all. it, there was points where you weren't invested. I would say. Only points. <clears throat> uh, another thing I'd say was a pro, I guess, would be like the family. Uh, I think I like Wyatt Russell, and I like some of the relationships in it. Um, because the story is mainly centered around all four of them, the two kids and the parents. And so you get a lot of a a time with them. And so I think that is a decent part of the movie. Um, along with, I guess the premise, you know, it's a, I mean, what we have a pool haunting people. <laughs> yeah. Different kind of what's next. A car, a house. Oh, we've already had a house. <laughs> Honestly, dude, it wasn't a good movie. Yeah, honestly, this movie was mid, bland, generic. Not as bad as The Nun, though. Or The Marvels. Actually, <laughs> I don't know about that. Oh. I don't know about that. <laughs> there's not really a lot of pros in this movie. There's not. Um, <clears throat> there's some jump scares, but even then, they're predictable. You see him coming. I mean, one got Tyrell. He was like, ah! <laughs> yeah, I screamed. I don't know about that. We'll go into some of the cons, and you can go ahead. Oh, where to begin? The people are brain dead. Everyone that goes into the pool, they just go right back. I think like every character that got in the pool, this happened to them. They'd get in the pool, go under the water, and then like something would fall in the water. Or they'd like look up and see like something, someone standing. And then they would get up like, hey! Huh? No one would be there. No one would be there and they're like, whatever. They're like, I'm just seeing things. Oh well. I'm just seeing things. Every single person, I swear. Another thing would be like... They have unlimited breath underwater. Oh my god, for real. This Tom Cruise is hold their breath. <laughs> Ten minutes. They're literally just swimming. And then the pool turned into some kind of ocean. They can keep swimming down and down and down. Oh my god, it's a trench. It's a trench. The night trench. <laughs> that would have oh. been a better movie title. Night swim. I guess that's the next thing. Night swim, but half of the things with the monster during the day. Yeah, that's a good thing sometimes when a movie, instead of waiting like the Demeter where it has to be night to for the thing to attack, they let it attack during the day, but night swim, not day swim. Literally. Yeah. Oh, and then another brain dead thing was when they see things happening in the pool and they're like, uh, the dad doesn't believe the kid. He's like, whatever. Anyways, let's throw a pool party. Invite everyone. He's pretending. He's just mess talking to his imaginary friend. Not to mention the acting of this movie. Yeah, not at even the just end, the logic. At the end, something critical happens to one of the characters. And one of the characters is like, is he okay? And it's like, is he okay? Really? He's so chill about it. Is he okay? Is he okay? One of the most important people in your life, no? Literally, you see him like almost died. And then at the end, what happens with one character and then how... It, the story moves on from that point. Really? If that happened to me, I don't know what I'd do. Like, I would be so devastated. You'd move? But would you? Are you sure you do? Is that what they would want? <laughs> Stupid. But no, the ending of this movie was kind of dumb. Um, the acting, the logic. You know, now that you say the ending was dumb, the beginning was kind of dumb too. And while we're at it, <laughs> you know what else is dumb? The middle. <laughs> oh, yeah. And then just everything in between all of those. Huh. I never thought of that. Yeah. 
<laughs> Overall, though, this movie, I mean, it was just bland, I would say. It's something we've seen in a bunch of other movies, especially the ending. We've seen it in a different movie, um, executed way better. Yes. Where it actually, you actually like, dang. The ending for this one just fell flat. So, like, some of the dumb logic was kind of funny. Yeah, it's like, why yeah, would you do that? Some of the humor, like, the guy who came to fix the pool, he was just talking dumb. <gasps> what? That was so weird. <laughs> it was bro, so just, weird. But it was like, bruh. Just sort of ranting. And then, like, something happened. He's like, oh, yeah, I don't know. So, yeah. He's yeah. like, humans want to, the this part of us, the reptilian part, they want to get back into the water. Okay. But the part of us just knows we don't belong there, so <laughs> it's like, like it's like, bro, just install my pool, like, <laughs> just fix it. No, but for this movie, after thinking long and hard about it, I would say I'm gonna give it the participation award. I don't think it's worth going to the movies for, unless you're bored oh, no. and have nothing to do. I guess. But even then, I don't know. Just buy the popcorn and go home. <laughs> oh. Watch something else. Is that what you're giving it? Oh, yeah, participation as well. All right, so with that being said, we just want to say thank you guys for watching this review. And um, drop a comment down below if you saw Night Swim and what your thoughts were on it. And then, yeah, tell us what you think of the new setup. Got the lights. Yeah, we got a new setup going. Oh. Still experimenting. You Ross gallo has got the lights. We got the we got this hookup here. Thanks to the YouTube money that you guys Yep, all the guys donations. Thank you. All the donations, oh. you know. It really means a lot. Um, yeah. Couldn't do it without you guys. So, yeah, with that being said, <laughs> thank you guys for watching this review. Um, comment below, like, subscribe, and we'll see you all in the next video. Peace.